Unified did not disappoint in his first time at a route distance mile and an eighth of today's Peter Pan here with trainer Jimmy Jerkins. Now, I'm not asking you to reveal all your secrets, but I was looking at a different horse in the paddock today as far as his attitude. Give us a gist of just how you got this guy ready to go a much further distance than the seven eights last time out. Well, we've been, you know, we, we worked them a couple of times long. You know, with Calvin, my my been my main rider for the last 15 years, and you know, we're not guys like that. You can't get it done. So he under, he knows exactly what I what I want, and uh, it got a little hairy there with the bad weather. We thought we were, you know, we uh, one of those days we wanted to give him a good work and we couldn't. We had to wait another almost another uh, four or five days, and then, and then that route work that went into the fog. So, but <laughs> we were able to time him, and he went a nice 13 out in 27, which is in company with a horse that runs tomorrow, securities, and he got a lot out of it. He had a, he had a run to get by him, and, and, and uh, I think if he didn't have that work, I don't think he would have won today. But we got, we got lucky. He got ridden perfect. He stayed, he stayed in, the, in, in the path where it was, excuse me, <coughs> in the path where it was the fastest today, and, uh, and the track was very, very fast today, which certainly helps when you're stretching out. Yeah, exactly. And looking at, you know, the mile and an eighth, do you think he's a horse that will continue on that road? Or are you going to kind of cut back here? I mean, we are, what, three weeks or almost a month away um, from, you know, the Belmont Stakes Festival. Is there a race that you would like to point him for during that time? It's really hard to say. It's a good question. We're kind of, we're kind of in the middle. Don't really know which direction to go, to be honest with you. But at least, he, you know, if this is a big stepping stone, at least, you know, um, something, a race like the Belmont, that's probably something that's probably – you know, kind of really getting in front of ourselves, but uh, but at least you know he did get the route. And I thought, which I really liked was, even though he was getting a little late there, I watched him gallop out. And when Christoph Swartz pulled up to him, and out he took off. So you know that was I, I, I was happy to see that he wasn't he wasn't completely spent. He had something left. Well, Jimmy, once again, a great job and congratulations with Unified here in the Peter Pan. Thank you very much. All right, that's trainer Jimmy Jerkins, successful keeping unified undefeated here in today's Peter Pan.